Hello everyone, my name is Becca and welcome to Yellow Cat Studios. For today's video, I'm going to be doing something a little bit different. Um, I got some metal stamping supplies for Christmas and I thought it'd be kind of fun to document uh, my journey learning how to use it. So I got this stamp and block set. It's um, Odin. <laughs> This comes with the alphabet and a little and symbol, and then the stamping block. And I also got a set of a few different um, pendant pieces. So there's circular ones and bar ones in silver, rose gold, and gold. And for now, I'm just going to be using the hammer out of my toolbox. <laughs> so I've done a little bit of research, um, but I think I'm just going to kind of go for it. I do have a little bit of felt um, if I want to put it over, I guess, the hammer or the block to kind of dampen how loud this is going to be. <laughs> but I think I'm just going to maybe start with an R on one of the round ones and see how it goes. Okay, so that actually comes out a lot smaller than I thought it would and I definitely need more pressure because that's not very deep. Um, I was a little worried that these were going to be big for these pendants, but it actually worked quite well. That was fun. You, you can't, you can't see it. Hello. There it is. <laughs> okay. So because I'm just practicing, I think I'm just going to flip it to the other side to see if I can get the pressure a little bit better, um, just so I don't waste a whole bunch of uh, the pendants. I forgot to hit record on that one, but that one was better. So I don't know if you're going to be able to tell the difference. This was the first side, that is the second side. You can kind of tell, but it's definitely deeper and more even. Cool. Okay, now I'm going to try a little bar and I'm going to do a word. Um, I think I'm just going to do create because I can't think of anything else right now. <laughs> you need to move your head. Now, mm, I should actually write this down so I can space it out properly. Okay, so I just wrote out my word um, and I used my stamp as a reference for the size. So I'm just gonna kinda try and keep it lined up on there and we're gonna go for it. Create is such a weird word. It looks wrong. Okay, so my spacing was a little bit off. I didn't line up my R right, so it, it got a little closer towards the end. Um, and aside from 
create looking weird in all caps. <laughs> I think that was pretty good. And for a few of them, I like tapped it twice. Um, and it worked. So I think as long as I don't move <laughs> after I tap it once, I can tap it a couple times to make it a deeper indent. Cute! Okay. <laughs> okay, this one went very bad. But, learned a couple things. First of all, I was going too close to the top edge there. Um, so I need to watch where I'm placing it from all sides. Um, the R got double stamped because I moved when I hit it the second time. So if I use my finger to anchor my hand when I'm stamping, that worked better towards the end there. Because all of those I double stamped. And I also started too far for that long of a word. <laughs> okay. Honestly, this could be going worse. Okay, so I was trying a few more and I don't think hitting it multiple times <laughs> is a good idea because I did a few this one's really bad. On this one, that is supposed to be an AND symbol. Um, and that was two or three hits. This one, I flipped it over. This was one hit that I just tried to do a little bit harder. And that worked a little better. try it again over here so this one was two hits and obviously I had it on a little bit of an angle because part of it is missing and the other side was one hit again was on a little bit of an angle because the bottom is missing there so this is definitely gonna take some <laughs> practice. I'm gonna have to get a lot of little pendants and things, but yeah. So I think I'm gonna leave this video here for now. Um, I might do this as kind of a little mini series where as I kind of learn more things with metal stamping and get better at it, I'll do little little update videos. Um, but I'm very excited about this. I've been wanting to do this for a while and I think it's going to be a lot of fun. So I hope you enjoyed my little intro testing metal stamping. Um, if you metal stamp and you have any tips, please leave them in the comments. I would very much appreciate it. <laughs> If you enjoyed this video, leave a like and subscribe. I really appreciate it. Um, I hope you have a good day, afternoon, or evening, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.